Ed Townend. I uh, work in Cardiff uh, doing music kind of all around South Wales. Yeah, so my name is James Aimer. I'm the assistant manager of the Bootleg of Bars in Cardiff. I think the Welsh music scene as a whole is kind of it, it does differ because it's got it's a very personal identity. It's quite a small country, and the fact that um, you know there's, there's lots about language that is involved in Wales, and Wales is often called the land of song. For, uh, Wales is quite an old country, as well as being quite a small country. It's lots of heritage to in Welsh music. Yeah, Cardiff's got a massive, massive music culture that's constantly growing uh, every year. Uh, this street in particular, Wombi Street, uh, I, from what I've seen, is the most diverse music culture seen anywhere. The different styles of music, your heavy rock, heavy metal, your blues, just swing, rock and roll, um, R&B, all these types of genres, but bringing so many people together, which is a very good thing to see. Street in particular I think has been seen as like the focus of Cardiff's music scene. There was some threat to it a couple of years ago. People are much more engaged in like some wider than just the music, which I think is really, really important. It's more homely in Cardiff. It's a huge community. Uh, it needs to be in the Barn Street. So the Cardiff Music Award is something I established um, to recognise uh, music in Cardiff. I really thought that putting, you know, Cardiff music on the map in that way and kind of giving, you know, feedback and like praise to organisations or to people that have like really pushed the boundaries in, in Cardiff and like worked really hard, I think it's really important.